there are media reports that uh, I'm among the prominent people from Mount Kenya region who have been sidelined by this uh, current government. I want to state very clearly, from the time of uh, the former president, the late president Moi, through to President Kibaki, all along uh, Uhuru's government and current one, I don't remember any time, any time, in any occasion, when I was blocked from going to see a minister or to get access to a state house or any public gathering or where I was embarrassed or blocked. I don't remember making any application for any job that was denied. I don't remember being uh, even mistreated by even Nyumbakumi, let alone any other person. They have held me with the highest decorum. In all police stations that I have been, and thank you very much, police stations, they support me. Even when we are, we are fighting uh, uh, bad alcohol and the rest of it, they support me 100%. County commanders, whether county commissioner or regional commissioner, or name it, not a single instance have I ever gone to a permanent secretary's uh, office or anybody in the Palastato or CEO or a chairman of a Palastato and I, never, I was not accorded any respect. Mutu lazima awe na heshima ili heshimiwe. Mimi niko na heshima zangu na mimi na enjoy maximum. Wakati huu wa Raithi Ruto na serikali yake hakuna mtu, hakuna mtu ambaye amenitenga. Mimi sija hadika balua yote ya kuuliza kazi, alafu ni kakataliwa, sija ulizwa yote. Ile kitu mimi sifanyi, mimi sifanyi tenders. Na hizo tenders niliwacha kutoka tangu 1990s, mimi sifanyi hizo, hizo vitu. Mimi na shuhurika na matibabu ya wale watu ambao wa meathiriwa, na hili janga rapombe, eh, pombe haramu, na, na, na vileo kijumra. Lakini mimi sija dhurumiwa na mtu ya yote. I repeat, I have not been harassed by this government. There is nobody from Nyumbakumi all the way to the president himself. And every time we have come across with him a number of occasions, he stops and greets me with the utmost respect. Even whether, whether you are talking of military commanders, you are talking of uh, pro administration police commanders, you are talking of, of uh, police service commanders, chairmen and the rest of it. I'm okay. I'm at peace with myself. I'm good. I'm serving the people of Kenya. Kila mua. Mzigo wake mwenyewe na kila mtu wewe kila mtu atabeba mzigo wake mwenyewe hawa watu wanajuana tunajuana mheshimiwa gachagua deputy president tunajuana sana hata wakati alikuwa anafanya campaign to 2000 mimi sikumbuki akiniuliza any advice mimi sijui walianzana wapi na mheshimiwa Ruto na sijui wanaishia wapi you know the lion. The lion has three major attributes. Three. Number one, very intelligent. A lion is one of the most intelligent animals in the park. Number two, very brave. It's able to bring on a buffalo, which is five times its mass. But most important, it does its own fight. A lion, kama pundamulia anapigana na uko, ama wale wengine anapigana ashuguriki. I behave like a lion. I do my own battles. I would like to do my own battles, and at the moment, I don't have any battles. I would like to tell them that uh, whatever they are doing, let it be in the confines of decorum. That's all. We don't discuss things which are not supposed to be heard by the general public because they scare everybody. I also want to caution my people, particularly our, people, our leaders in Nakuru. The fallout of uh, Gachagua does not, is not a declaration of war in Left Valley. It is completely different ballgame. Ata wakati ameshaguliwa tu kuona sharia hapa. So it, is, it should stay like that. My, their own deals, wamaliza hizo deals zao, wasign, yeah? We are aware. There were pre-election uh, deals. If we didn't have a deal, we didn't have a deal. The next elections, we'll have proper deals. And then the matter ends up there. I will, not, I will not bother the least whether somebody has been appointed a minister or a CS or whatever it is. Listen to we had a CS here. Since he was appointed, I don't remember him seeing. Even during the floods, I didn't see him. In fact, I was sometimes thinking that he's a, a, a minister for mineral water because there are so many mineral water 
things that I saw around here. It didn't bother me. And, and that's it. That was the situation. Yeah? Minding own business. And only talking when you are directly confronted by an issue. Right now I'm not confronted by an issue. And if the media is aware of any, let them alert me. I've had issues, which is uh, business issues, with the one of the plastatos dealing with NHIF. But they have solved the problem themselves, Uko. But I'm not. I'm not. Niko Sawa. Yeah. Yo, Mamba I, I can only explain to you what happens in politics. The people who rule is a closed members club. They do their own terms and they agree on what. During the last the last elections, I was humiliated. I was humiliated by having somebody who is opposite my beliefs. He promotes alcohol. I fight bad alcohol. But that was it. The system favored that particular particular person. I remember going to one of the polling stations at Kiamuni, and by 8 o'clock, the ballot box for senator was full. All the others were empty. Not even half empty, they were empty. I just knew it straight away that the, the way it's going is that Mutudo's policies are not coherent with the ones who are coming to power that particular time. And that was it. So, what I would tell my friend uh, Gachagua, with a lot of humility and respect, I would ask him just to resign quietly, plan his game again, and not force all these kind of hula balloons we are going to hear, including where he slept yesterday and which hotel he bought or he did not buy. That, that's, a, that's unnecessary. Let's talk about how shall we make Kenya a better place. That's much more important. And for the president, you are Christian, you, are, you can forgive, and you do forgive. Find it easy in your heart to forgive this gentleman who is your partner, and tell him to shut up. And, and before coming to the extreme of chasing him away, because whether a man is short, tall, black, or what, what is important is what is in his soul. And if you two can forgive each other, in the spirit of Christianity and peace and stability of your leadership, that's good enough. As we pray for this nation, that's what I can say. Yeah. I'm not a church leader myself. I respect them for who they are. They, they know their doctrine. I'm a Catholic, and my church has spoken loud. The bishops have spoken loudly on what they want done. I follow that creed. And the interesting thing about our church, and I will invite you to Catholicism, is that even if you come to China, you go to China or to Russia, you can still celebrate Mass with them, even when you don't understand the language. There is a system, there is a creed, there is a belief that we, we share, all of us around the world. And we are, we are overseered by the bishops. So the positions of the bishops is our positions.